Hey everybody, how you doing out there? Is this you recording? You recording? And this is yours truly, day, day. Woo! Yeah, welcome to my podcast. Audio portion only, guys. No visuals. I'm sorry to say, yeah. No uh, visuals. Uh, just the audio portion. And uh, I want to state that publicly. No, no uh, visuals. No, uh, uh, you know, film or video. We're going to have audio only, and I want to address this uh, straight uh, head on, like the elephant in the room. I want to address this, uh, I really want to address this now, here, and right now. I want to say to all you uh, American voters, keep voting, keep voting, and keep doing what you do best, and keep voting for the next president of the United States. And by the way, by the way, this podcast is brought to you by In Stereo, uh, and it does sound like it's In Stereo. Uh, mind you, this is, this is American politics, m- American election. I want to give kudos where kudos is due. You got Donald Trump, uh, his, uh, his real name is Donald J. Trump. Joe Biden is called Joel, uh, I forget his middle name, uh, Biden, last name Biden. So, yeah, Vice President Joe Biden, and, uh, yeah, it's too early to call. I'll put that in the title. Too early to call, uh, from my vantage point. Uh, and, uh, yeah, so all you people out there, keep voting, keep doing what you do. Uh, we got to we gotta count those bell bucks, and, uh, yeah, so remember, it's too early to call, and uh, I'm going to give you on the rebound on this. Uh, so uh, until until we get some real numbers, we need to uh, hit the number of, the, as they say, the magic number of 270 uh, votes. So there you go, folks. I'm out of here. We haven't reached that number at the moment. Present day, we got 253 to 213. That's uh, uh, Joe Biden's got 253. Uh, Donald Trump's got 213. We're hitting that way to 270. 270. This is my podcast. Whether you like it or not, it's my podcast. And I, I just, I'm just so glad that everybody is listening to this present day. We're in the year of 2020, not in 1980s. And, uh, yeah, so I'm going to do a podcast in stereo, not mono sound. It's going to sound in stereo. So right and left microphone, I'm gonna, it's like uh, right and left microphone, it's going to sound really, really dynamic sound. And uh, I'm really, really happy that I'm doing this podcast, uh, podcast because of you guys. And I'm just, I'm just livid that I'm, I'm seeing this uh, history unfold uh, with the President of the United States. I'm really, really seeing democracy in action. I really appreciate that. I saw the commissioners. Uh, I saw a few uh, people the other day. I saw uh, Lindsey Graham. I almost forgot his name. Lindsey Graham, the Senator Lindsey Graham, who's chair, chair, uh, chair guy of the uh, uh, disciplinary committee. Uh, he still is, uh, Lindsey Graham and uh, Mitch McConnell, who's a senator. Mitch McConnell, everybody, is a senator in Capital, uh, capital City in Washington, D.C. He's Mitch McConnell, and he's a senator, guys. He's not the President of the United States. He's a senator. So I want to iterate something here, and Vice President Mike Pence, still Mike Pence, and you got Donald Trump, and you got Kamala Harris, almost forgot about here. Uh, she still uh, still does what she does, but she's not a vice president yet. She will be if Donald Trump, if uh, <laughs> sorry, if uh, Joe Biden wins this thing. Until then, uh, we're just gonna keep doing what we do best in the podcast. Hope you guys like it. Uh, we're gonna watch this thing to the bitter end, and I do mean the bitter end. Until we get that matchup number of two thousand uh, two hundred and seventy votes. Until we get that magic number, I'm not going to say anything. I really mean that, folks. I'm not going to say anything until then. We, until we get a victory speech. Until we say, yay, kind of victory speech that we all want to hear about. It's like song and dance victory speech. Uh, I want to hear from Donald Trump, either from Donald Trump or from Joe Biden, the victory speech that they're all clamming for. Um, the uh, That everybody will be happy about it. And everybody would be cheering in the background four more years. They'll be saying four more years or Joe Biden, yay, kind of thing. Uh, and uh, we're going to wait to the victory speech. I'm so waiting for the last, what, three, uh, three days or four days? 
Anyway, whatever many days it is, we're waiting for the magic number. And uh, I'm just here to give you info on, on the American election. The American election is heating up, and every second, every time a commissioner or a senator speaks out uh, on the media, uh, we're going to get the votes that we needed. And I'm not kidding. We haven't talked about the coronavirus yet. It's in the back burner. The coronavirus is in the back burner. But uh, we're talking about electing a president of the United States to the Oval Office. Still president of the United States, still Donald Trump is still president of the United States. Joe Biden is going to be as soon as they get that magic number. As soon as they can get that magic number. And we're going to have a briefing room in a little while. A briefing room where the White House, the Oval Office is. And uh, it's either it's either that lady, Caitlin, I don't know what her name is. I keep forgetting her name. Uh, the press secretary lady. Or Donald Trump, who's the guy in the Oval Office. I like I like that Caitlin uh, lady. I like her. I like her just a bit. She's really good. At the beginning, uh, when she got her job, it, she was really fast at what she was saying. But she slowed down to what she said, says now. So there you go, folks.